Let's go. What's good, YouTube? I'm back at it again. If you don't know, my name is Lawrence, and I'm gonna be trying to do a hair video today. My hair is already freshly washed, detangled, moisturized, and braided up. I um, just made another video doing my wash day routine. It was kind of hard to explain, but if you want to go see that video, please watch that. I'll link that down in the description. Um, today, I'm gonna take out these braids since my hair is gonna be stretched, and I'm gonna try to go for this style right here. Um, I have an event to go to that I'm going away for a few days, so I'm trying to make sure my hair is nice and prepared for that. I don't know if I'm gonna do it in braids or I'm gonna try to do that same parting style and flat twist, so we'll see how that goes. So I'm just gonna start off by taking out these braids and starting with a little bit of oil on my hands. I like uh, this one, Carol's Daughter, God of Strength. And I'm just gonna put a little bit of that on my hands. Make sure it's on my fingertips so the braids don't get extremely frizzy. I'm gonna go ahead and start taking them down. I'm gonna start with this one. So this is what it looks like after I just took out the first braid. It's pretty defined, really moisturized. That's why it looks like that. I think I'm gonna go ahead and just um, brush out this section so that there's no, so that the curl pattern doesn't stay in there because I'm gonna try to keep it as stretched as possible for the style. I just used this um, Tangled teaser that I got from, from Ulta or something like that. And I'm just gonna take the section and just make sure it's detangled again. Just like that, nice and stretched out. Now I'm gonna do that for the rest of my head. so I can show you what it looks like all combed out have afro mode on this is what it looks like all generally detangled Gonna be pretty easy to part and it's moisturized okay that's it now I'm gonna take a break time check it is 10 13 p.m. right now supposed to show you the one part that I did but I went ahead and just did one braid all the way down took a long time to part but the braiding section actually wasn't that difficult and how it turned out on that. Now I'm gonna try to do like maybe three more on this side and see how that turns out. I use my laptop back here if you can see to see the back of my head and that's what I'm doing. Basically usually do this in the mirror in the bathroom, but I just kind of follow. It doesn't part super easy, but just go slow. Uh, it's a little thick, so I'll, I'll take it from a smaller angle. Like that. And then I'll just follow it all the way down to the back and I'll show you what that looks like. So this is what the part looks like from behind. Just like that. 
you can see all the way down and now I'm just gonna apply um, the Cheyenne Jam gel I use this to I use this to part and just to keep it plus it's like it still moisturizes my hair it's not too heavy and I just will put that on sleek it down and I'll show you how I how, I, how I'll start to braid it yeah and I just finished the second braid you can see so it looks like the end looks pretty good now I'm just gonna do this last one I'm gonna do this one off camera then I'm gonna start to part the rest so yeah the reality is the time check right now is 4 36 a.m. yes you heard that 4 36 a.m. this is what I have see three done on this side two done on this side currently trying to part the third one on this side right now and that's just that's just what it is just gotta get it done keep going one braid left time check is 8 12 a.m. I fell asleep took a nap but Getting there. I have one break left as you can see. Looks pretty good. Can I get this over with? Alright. These are the braids finally finished. Finally, this is what they look like. Do they look good? Pretty good. And there's barely any frizz considering it took this long. So I'm gonna go ahead and use, I really need some shine and jam mousse, but I'm just gonna use a little bit of the African pride mousse right here. Take off my glasses, spray this. And that's it, all wrapped up. I'll show you guys what it looks like after it's after all the flowers have been laid. When I take off my do rag, I'll show you a picture in the sun. Right now, I'm gonna take a nap. Bye. I forgot to show what my braids look like before I left yesterday. So here's what it looks like a day later, out in the sun-ish, even though it's cloudy. the finished product. I think they turned out pretty good. Thanks for watching.